Right, what we're going to try and set up here is a vacuum tube with an electric field and also a magnetic field and we're going to try and measure the charge to mass ratio for an electron. Andrew's going to show us how to set this up then. So we'll start with an HT, that's a high tension supply. We're going to use 5000 volts. This is being connected to the anode of the vacuum tube. And that 5000 volts has also been connected to the top terminal. So we're going to have a, a positive plate at the top. 5000 volts and then we need a lower voltage a low voltage of about 6 volts which is going to the heater at the back of the vacuum tube which produces the electrodes that are then going to be accelerated through that high voltage in the electron gun. So many wires. Now again, our high tension supply of 5000 volts is being used to accelerate the electrons. It's my phone. And also that high tension supply is being connected top and bottom to produce the voltage across the two plates to give us our electric field. The low voltage is 6 volts going to the back of the tube. Ok Professor, what's next? Turn on the... You've turned that on there haven't you? Let it warm up. Let it warm up. It's now connecting a DC supply. We've got two 6 volt battery packs. So we've got 12 volts DC, and this is going to supply the current to the Helmholtz coils. Connected A to A, Z to Z. Okay, that's A to A, Z to Z on both the coils. And then we'll switch on the current, and the current in the coils will produce a magnetic field. So, increasing the voltage to 5000 volts. Okay. And again, if we turn off the current, we get the beam deflection due to the electric field. And then turn on the DC current, and the beam straightened out by the magnetic field. Current there, 0.35 amps from our 12 volt supply. High tension supply, 5000 volts. What's the separation of the plates? 10 centimetres. 5.6 centimetres. Then we can do the maths. Q over M.